Hi there, and welcome to my Wheel Throne Pottery Series. In this video, we'll actually be pulling up the side wall of our previously centred and opened out donut of clay here. So I personally think this is probably the most difficult of all the processes. Um, centering obviously is difficult in itself, but uh, to actually pull up the side wall is, is quite a uh, tricky process. So what are we aiming to do here? Well essentially to squeeze the sides of the clay and pull it up. Now we've only got 500 grams of clay here so we'll be able to achieve that with just using our fingers and pinching it like this. As the pots get taller you'll have to actually use your two hands and use one hand on the inside and one hand on the other. But I would suggest you start with just using one hand and supporting it with the other and then just pinching it. So if you put some water onto the onto the pot, uh, don't normally you would want not to get as much water in the bottom of the pot as this, it can cause S cracks, but as we're just practicing here, make it really as wet as you can so that your fingers don't stick to that side wall. So place your fingers in around about the uh, four or five o'clock position on the wheel. Run the wheel reasonably slowly, not too quick, about half speed probably. And then just lightly rest them on the on the clay. You'll be able to feel the clay running through. If it's, if it's sticky, then put more water on. They should run very, very smoothly through the clay there. And what you're aiming to do, as I say, is just pinch in very slightly. Just do it very lightly to start with. Hold your other hand steady and then just pinch in very slightly and just pull up. Say hardly any pressure at all. And then as you get to the top of the clay, just release the pressure very slowly. And that way you'll, you'll get a feel for the, for the clay as it goes round in your fingers. You don't want to grab too much clay to start with because you'll just rip the whole thing off from the wheel here. So we'll put a bit more water on here and we'll do that again. And the, the finger on the inside of the pot is going to be slightly higher than your thumb on the outside. So yeah, just on the base of the clay there, squeeze it together and then just pull it up. Only light pulls. You don't need to you don't need to pull the whole wall up at once. I mean generally you once you're more experienced, you'll better pull the walls up in about three pulls, but again, at this stage, really it's uh, just getting a feel for the clay as it goes around. So more water, fingers in position, supported with the other hand, just squeeze it and then just pull it up and you'll hopefully see the side wall is staying reasonably consistent. Now if you get started getting a sort of a ridge on the top here. What you can do is just put a bit more water on. Thanks. And then pinch your fingers up towards the top and then just rest your other finger on the front, your finger and thumb there. Just press down slightly. And you'll remove that, actually remove that ridge from the top there. So keep on going like that. It doesn't matter if you stop going out a bit, you'll get the feel of it. Gradually press a little more each time. Just run your finger on the top there. Down. Keep it nice and nice and wet. Okay. Again. And as you can see, you gradually the wall of this is getting Taller. Again, press the just press down on that top bit. I want to try and keep that as even as possible. If it starts to uh, to run out vertically, um, then don't worry at this point. You can cut it off with the pin tool, but um, you pro you'll probably find that will be a little bit difficult. So we'll just do one more, more water. Hands in there. Support it with the other hand. 
pinch at the bottom and pull up very slowly. Try and keep your hand pushing in towards the centre a bit so that it doesn't start to spin out of control. So there we are. Pull the side wall up. We've got far too much water actually inside the pot here, which you, again you wouldn't normally do, but for this exercise it really doesn't matter. And I will just sponge that out. That. And this is the um, this is the basis for virtually all uh, vases and bowls. Uh, once you can do this, then you're well on your way to forming pretty much anything. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please like it and subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much.